Friday, and in this episode, I want to talk about was not, and then our weight goal, and then weight maintenance. It's a journey. It's a long journey for the rest of your life. If you want wealth, wellness, and fitness. You know, I have to say that I had a great Mother's Day and happy Mother's Day to all of your moms. And, you know, I, I'm very proud of my three adult children. They're all in the business of public service. My son is fire captain. My other son is the paramedic. They're both in the fire department and my daughter is such a loving and caring nurse. So after Sunday, I have to tell you that I just couldn't kick my sadness. It was just overbearing. I couldn't function. And then certain events came up and didn't handle them the best that I could. And then I couldn't get in my groove of exercise. It was just, I kept hitting that wall and my scale went up. It just didn't, this week did not work. So one of the things that, again, that you have to remember is that the journey of weight loss is mind, body, and soul. So with saying that, I needed to really take care of my soul, me. If I want to continue on this journey, then it's not just the weight loss. It's developing yourself from within because beauty is not on the outside. Your appearance, it's not. It comes from the inside out. So I really needed to take a look at my soul. What did I need to get me through this week? And I can't totally say that I'm out. So what I have done is really taken a step back and said, what do I need? What loving actions or things do I need? What needs to happen? What, how do I take care of myself in a loving way? Well, first of all, I needed to be patient with myself. I needed to make sure that I was sleeping properly and make sure that I was, even though I didn't do well on my plan this week, I needed to continue to stay the course. And I have to tell you that with all of what was going on, I was craving sugar and I had sugar. And I had to say to myself, it's not the end. I'm going to be patient. I'm going to be kind and I'm going to continue to do what I know I needed to do. So I have to say to you that one of the key things when you are looking at your soul in your journey is to remember that you want to be loving to your, towards yourself. You want to be kind. You want to be patient. You want to be long suffering as well in that events are going to happen. And since you're becoming a new person, you're changing. So does your soul change and so does your emotions change and you want to make the best decisions and they will come. The answers come from speaking to others, maybe journaling, maybe listening to personal development or if you are a believer in Christ, praying and listening to others that have wisdom and that have great counsel. 
Take time. Be still. For me, I keep thinking, be still and know that he is God and I'm not. And there comes the answers and the wisdom. Just waiting. Just wait. And then the most beautiful thing happens is that time passes and you find yourself in a different place, in a good place. And sometimes maybe it could get worse, but remember everything passes. It passes and time heals. And so as you are in this journey of weight loss, of your weight goal and maintenance, you're going to find that life is still gonna continue to happen and you're going to change. So allow that change, be patient. So I will come at you next week on Friday and we'll see what the journey will be for next week. Have a great weekend. Join me with my channel. I'm on Facebook. I'm on Twitter, Instagram. Join me as I post on my daily activity. I'll be posting pictures coming up on my weight loss. And remember, be good to yourself. Sleep, get plenty of sleep, drink